salaries. These are not things to put at risk. Major Internet firms in the United States have begun releasing data about the amount of user information they secretly hand over to the government. A legal deal reached last week allows the companies to disclose broad details about the number of orders they receive from the secret Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Court. Yahoo, for example, reports it received Pfizer requests for user content affecting at least 30,000 accounts during the first six months of last year alone. In Germany, a hacker group has filed a criminal complaint accusing the government of Chancellor Angela Merkel of illegally helping the United States spy on Germans. Outcry in Germany previously erupted over news the U.S. spied on Chancellor Merkel's cell phone. But the Chaos Computer Club now accuses Merkel's government of illegally collaborating with the National Security Agency and its British counterpart. In a recent interview with the German TV station NDR, NSA whistleblower Edward Snowden described the relationship between German and U.S. spy agencies. I would describe it as intimate. Uh, as a matter of fact, the first way I described it in a written interview was that uh, the German services and the U.S. services are in bed together. They not only share uh, information, the reporting, the results from intelligence, but they actually share the tools and the infrastructure. They work together against joint targets um, and services. And there's a lot of danger in this.